I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and God has called and commissioned me to lead people of all walks of life to a deep and genuine encounter with Him. My dear friend, I encourage you as I pray for you today and as I share a message with you, be in agreement, believe and you shall receive in the name of Jesus. Hello to you my dear friend, it's Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez here and it's so good to be with you today. It is indeed another day that God has given us by His grace and by that same grace my dear friend we will press on and receive the prize that God has for us. You know my dear friend, God has given each and every one of us a vision, a heavenly vision. It's so essential that in our lifetime we accomplish this vision that God has given us. Your vision might be to have a house, your vision might be to have a certain business, your vision might be to start a ministry. Your vision might be to, to work a certain job. Maybe you want to work in the UN. Whatever your vision might be, God has given you a vision for your life. But in order to accomplish that vision, my dear friend, you are going to need to set goals. Today, I'm going to pray for you that you will make much progress even as you set goals. You need goals in your life. Now, what are goals, my dear friend? Goals are small milestones along the way in accomplishing your vision. So if you set goals, these goals ultimately as you hit them, as you accomplish them, they should lead you to your vision. They should lead you to fulfilling the bigger picture. My dear friend, it's so essential that we have goals in life. Do you have any goals? Have you set any goals for this year of 2019? Have you decided on what you want to accomplish in this year? God wants you to decide. God wants you to pray over your goals. As you pray over your goals, you will make much progress. As you receive your goals from the Heavenly Father and you pray over your goals, you will make much progress. My dear friend, as a man of God, I want to see you make progress. I want to see you make progress in your life. I want you to accomplish that vision that God has given you. And as you set goals and you fulfill those goals, you meet those tasks, those obligations, those goals, you will get closer to that vision. My dear friend, on this channel you know that we always pray to go from glory to glory, from level to level. In order to move in another level, you need to accomplish the goals in the previous level. As you accomplish those goals, my dear friend, you will move up and you are steps closer to accomplishing the vision that God has given you. It's so essential that you accomplish this vision in life. Maybe it's in business, maybe it's in working a certain job. Wherever God needs you to be, only God knows and you also know. And as God has revealed that to you, my dear friend, it's so essential that you accomplish it. And you're going to accomplish it as you set goals. Today, I want us to go into a time of prayer and I want us to begin to pray. As we pray, God is going to do something amazing. He's going to touch you and He's going to give you the divine ability so that the remaining of this year, you will accomplish all the goals that you set, even the ones that you've already missed. You will accomplish them and you'll go to a greater glory, my dear friend. I want to tell you something I've seen in my lifetime. I've seen so many testimonies. I've seen what God can do. I've seen the deliverance working power of God. I've seen God taking situations that were a big mess and turning them around. So what more are your goals, my dear friend? He can take those goals that you were supposed to accomplish a year ago and He can help you to accomplish them this year as long as accomplishing 2019's goals. 2019, you will make much progress whether the devil likes it or not. My dear friend, as you stay close to God and you remain in prayer, as you believe and you trust God, as you put your faith out there and you decide, I am going to believe in God no matter what. As you develop a faith that is very bold, a faith that does not give up, a faith that says, I'm going to seek God no matter what, you will accomplish great things, my dear friend. Because those who put their trust in the Lord, will never be disappointed. In saying that, my dear friend, let's go into a time of prayer. On this channel, we always begin by praising God. And even as we begin to praise God, the presence of God will come in the place and God will touch and change your life forever. In saying that, my dear friend, let's begin to praise Him. Praise Him in your own words. Father, You are our God and we just praise You. We love You, Lord, and we can't live without You. There is no other God like You. We just give you all the praise, we give you all the honor, we give you all the glory. You alone are worthy of all praise. Lord, today, even as we pray, as we seek you, receive all the praise, O oh God. I pray this in Jesus' mighty name, and I thank you for it, Lord. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. My dear friend, our Lord is gracious. He is a merciful God. He is a good God. 
If you put your trust in Him, you will not be disappointed. If you haven't already set goals, my dear friends, set some goals that will help you to accomplish that life vision and that life purpose. My dear friend, it's so essential that you make progress in life. And the way that you can track your progress is by setting goals and accomplishing those goals. So whether your life vision is to get to know Christ more, set some goals. Say you're going to read through the Bible this year. If your life vision is to start a business, work on that business. Set some milestones that you want to hit. If your life vision is to do something great, to do something wonderful, set a goal, whatever it is. Set a goal and go ahead and start to accomplish it, my dear friend. I want to tell you something, my dear friend. The world is your playground and no one is stopping you from doing what God has called you to do. You can go out and you can do it. You can impact the whole world. One person can impact the world, but you have to be willing to do so, my dear friend. You can do so by the grace that is available in Christ. And today, right now, we're going to go into a time of prayer. I'm going to begin to pray for you so that you can receive the grace that is needed in order to accomplish that life vision that God has given you. And even as we pray, God is going to bless you. But now, as we go into a time of prayer, I want to encourage you to do two simple things. The first thing that I want you to do, my dear friend, is lift up your hands and say this with me. Say, Holy Spirit of God, I welcome you. Come and touch me, Holy Spirit. Come and take me to a greater glory. Come and take me to a greater level. Come and take me to a greater altitude, O Holy Spirit. Do what only you can do in my life, O Holy Spirit, and give me goals. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. My dear friend, the second thing that I want to encourage you to do is comment down below in the comment section and agree with me. So comment and agree, my dear friend, even as I begin to pray for you. But in saying that, let's begin to pray. Father, I pray for my dear friend. Lord, first of all, I pray. If you haven't given my dear friend a life vision, Give my dear friend a vision. Give my dear friend a purpose in life. Let my dear friend understand and let, and let it become clear to my dear friend what you have planned and what your purpose is for my dear friend. Lord, along with this, Lord, I pray that you'll give my dear friend the divine ability to set goals. And as my dear friend sets goals, Lord, release the grace over my dear friend so that my dear friend will accomplish those goals. Lord, I pray this year of 2019, release the grace over my dear friend's life that my dear friend will make progress. And if there's any evil that is fighting my dear friend's life, that is trying to stop my dear friend from making progress, Lord, I pray that you will remove all blockages of evil. I pray this in Jesus' name. Lord, right now, release your grace over my dear friend. Whatever my dear friend is trusting you for, Lord, let it be done. As long as it's in line with your word, let it be done. Lord, we know it is your will that we are blessed. It is your will that we are happy. It is your will that we are closer to you. It is your will that we shine with your light, not the worldly light, but with your light. Lord, therefore, let your light shine in my dear friend's life. Let your light shine in my dear friend's family. Let your light shine in my dear friend's community. Let your light shine in that vision, in that purpose, in that destiny, in those goals, in whatever area you've called my dear friend to, Lord. I pray this in Jesus' mighty name. But in saying that, my dear friend, we've come to the end of this video. From myself, Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, God bless you and goodbye. If you were blessed by this video and you'd like to give a seed, feel free to do so using any one of the secured links provided in the description. If you would like to partner with us to support the work of the gospel on a monthly basis, then you can do so via Patreon. The link for Patreon as well as other information is also provided in the description. Other than that, my friend, God bless you, God keep you, God make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. Until we meet again next time, Shalom and goodbye.